As a musician, you're going to be able to learn how to capture lead and what to do after you capture the lead. So in this video, I'm going to give you a simple process of how you capture leads and what to do after you capture the lead. So from the overall heading, there's several little nuances that you will have to understand, be able to incorporate within yourself to actually master these things. Don't rush nothing. Things take time. You can't learn everything all at once. You have to learn the small steps, the baby steps, understand them, then move on to the next. So how do you capture leads? When you capture leads, you can capture leads by creating a video, a static post, some UGC content, reaching out to other influencers to, you know, maybe give them a few dollars or some type of percentage. You work something out with them so that way they could post it on their page. You have your website, you write blogs, you send out emails. There's several different things that you can do to capture leads. So once you perform all of these things or just one thing or many different things to capture your leads, you're going to need to have a lead form. Now this lead form is going to capture their their email address, their first name, their last name, if you want their home address or business address, their phone number, all I capture and all I really want is your phone number, your email address and your name. First or last, it doesn't really matter, but I just want those three things so that way I could either do a text messaging campaign or I could do my definitely an email campaign. So to capture your leads, you create a post, your talents, your music, whatever it is that you're doing, generate the interest. These people click on it, like it, comment, whatever they do. They then go back to a lead form, whether it be on your website or just a regular page that's going to just capture the information or maybe just an Excel spreadsheet. However you're doing it, you have to find a way to get people's information. And once you get their information, you put them into the list and then that list should then put into an email automation. So that way you can send them new information about you, personal information, not too personal, but some stuff that could resonate with someone else or what new music you got coming out or anything exclusive, anything you're giving away. So if you want to learn how to do any of these things, join the Artistpreneur Academy. Click the link in the description, sign up now. We're going to show you how to do any and everything when it comes to being an artist, getting music out there, social media, business, publishing, credit, everything.